Hey guys, Therese from Tackle Tactics here. Today's video is gonna be on my top three Z-Man soft plastics for shallow water snapper. So let's take a close look into these lures. Okay, so let's take a closer look at these plastics and how I fish them. So the first one is the Z-Man Strix 3.75 inch jerk shad. So these here, they match the hatch really well. So what you're aiming to do is match the hatch with the little hardy heads, the smaller white bait that the snapper up there feeding on. The 3.75, nice little jerk bait that will do just that. I find I rigged these on a 1 8 2 0. The 1 8 fishing in about two to four meters of water has a good slow sink which gives us half a time to focus on that plastic. The next one is a four inch centered jerk shad. The four inch I found is a little, is a plastic that'll get a bit deeper. So when you're fishing off those ledges, a bit deeper off the ledges, the four inch jerk shad really does the job. Fish them on a quarter, let them sink down the edge of that ledge and the sapper come out and grab them. The next one is a Z-Man shrimps. Now I, look, I really am a shrimps lover. The shrimps, like the old saying, anything will eat a shrimp is very true. The shrimps, for me, confidence bait really. So the, the 3.5 inch easy shrimps here in particular has that nice segmented body, lifelike action. I'll generally hop these pretty fast and then let them slowly sink and rest back on the bottom. And greasy prawn, fried chicken, those nice natural colors do really well. The last one, is the Z-Man Strix curly towel. So the four inch curly towel is perfect. Again, we're matching that hatch. The four inch size is perfect. Fish them on a one six, a quarter in a three o, and same deal, just let it sink nice and slow. The tail here, being that Elastec 10 times tough, is where all the action comes from. Nine times out of 10, you'll cast it out, let it slowly sink, and the sap will just absolutely nail it. So the jig heads, again, your headlocks, nice strong hook, does the job perfectly. If you've got a range between 1 8, 1 6 and 1 quarter, you're pretty well gonna cover those shallow water snapper. So that's a wrap guys, and I hope that helps you get stuck into some shallow water snapper fishing. Any questions on the plastics or jig heads used in this video, leave a comment down below. For more informative how-to videos, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you on the next video.